Yay! We here! Comment! Where are they at? We all are here for one thing, and we are all here to see what uh, the community has in store for us today. All right, so here's the post. Let's see what kind of sweet treats await us. 329 comments. Oh man, that's gonna be a lot of scrolling. God, there's so many teenage show. Elon Musk saying a pog. Draw a medieval knight, but make him a full on frat boy. Any organ in the shape of a human creeper. Design an alien that mimics other creatures it sees and has become a hideous amalgamation. A spoon doing things spoons shouldn't do. Gordon Ramsay, yes. Like, I'm gonna need something to put in the thumbnail, you know what I mean? I think Gordon Ramsay is a very recognizable face. Might just try doing him. Maybe draw a Spider-Man helping the Minecraft spider, LMAO. Draw a god. Draw a dog chasing his tail. But he's going really fast and starting some whirlwinds or a tornado. Take a hit of salvia and draw what you see. Nice. nice. That's a pretty original one. Haven't seen anything like that before. Elon Musk's child in 15 years. Hmm. That's a good idea though. Maybe I should try molding <laughs> Elon Musk's and Grimes' faces together. Ronald McDonald eating something from Burger King. Oh yeah, they just opened the Burger King in Estonia and I just saw it. <laughs> there is like a huge f***ing queue. Social distancing is supposed to be a thing, but no. Burger King is the biggest thing in the world for f***ing commoners over here. Another person suggesting me to draw Elon Musk's kid. That moment when you take a bite of something really good and you just kind of salivate and pulls over your lips. Another one, that's like the third person requesting the same thing. Another XAA12 smoking a booth while his big titty goth girlfriend is holding him. Okay, draw Karen yelling at the whole thing. <laughs> I like that, I might do that. Redraw the characters from your fetish generator video. Did I have a a fetish Jenner? Oh yeah, I did. Emo Bob the Builder. Could you draw a moon blushing while looking at Elon Musk? What's what's up with everybody is such a big fan of Elon Musk? The apocalyptic prophet of COVID-19, the coronavirus, Jesus. Draw Isabella from Animal Crossing, but ripped. Sure, there's a plenty of people that have already done that. Your interpretation of how Elon Musk's alien baby looks like. That's the fifth person, God damn it. Okay, I'm gonna do it, but I'm gonna do something else first. Creature wearing a human suit. I wonder what kind of creature it would be though. The first thing that pops to mind is some kind of reptile, like some um, crocodile or alligator or some shit. Alligator. Alligal. Terrifying video shows an alligator climbing a fence at a US naval. Damn, I'm intrigued. All right, so check this out, guys. This is cool. I took this photo on my trip to the nature recently. Cue the vlog. <laughs> Hey, 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 looking for a spot to use as background for your comments. Those awful, awful comments. Let's go for a swim. Damn. I picked out seven spots for placement of things, so we're gonna do seven drawings today. I have a whole ass library of reptile pictures. Check these bad boys out. Oh, oh, hell yeah. Damn, he mad. All right, that should go something like this. The arms are gonna be a little bit too small to reach down for the knees. That's already looking quite human if I say so myself. Maybe you should be holding a phone. That's the most human thing you can do, right? Okay, they have kind of small arms, bendy, kind of round. So let's try to do that here. He do be just chilling though. He's <laughs> completely looking past the phone. Wait, first let me give him some balance. Damn, now his face is deformed. I know how I'm gonna solve this. I'm gonna try to make his ass be human in the color section. The suit should probably have like human ears. Oh my God, it looks like a mouse now or something. All right, let's color this bad boy now. Dude, I love this camera angle. It's like, you can see the tip of my pen. It's such an artistic camera angle. 
happened by accident. All right, let's give him a human skin color. He is as white as I am. All right, so let's give him some soft colors. The human suit needs to be open from somewhere. Maybe the tail comes out. This is where things break a little bit. This is where the normal alligator scales come out. Let's give him some nice reflections. All right, that looks pretty good. <laughs> now let's do the, do the rest of the body. Let's do the face and the head. And the face and the head. Yeah, face and the tail, you dummies. All right, some scales and shit, but the main source of uh, spice here is gonna be those uh, highlights, right? The highlights give your objects a sense of form if you place them correctly. Okay, there we go. There's our human suit wearing alligator who's checking his Instagram. Pretty cool one, cool one, pretty cool. One down, six to go. I think it's time for the Elon Musk thing now. Elon Musk's child and 15 mother trucking years. Okay, so let's, first off, let's do some research. What does Elon Musk baby? Elon Musk and Grimes cannot legally name their son XZ12. Yeah, I haven't kept up with the news. There was like this one thing one time that I stumbled upon where you take two people's you insert images of two people's faces and it mashes them together and creates a baby how the f do i search for it on google create baby from two people what the f baby a generator make me babies is a baby generator using face recognition to predict what your baby will look like okay so i'm just gonna screenshot these real quick bam bam we're processing your baby wow thank you But that doesn't look like what what this person will look like in 15 years. Wait, maybe I could insert this to face app and use the old filter or something. I don't want to download it though. Maybe I can find some alternative online. Changemyface.com. Try the demo. Oh my god. Okay, let's upload this photograph. Yeah, I agree to the terms and conditions, of course. Alright, so this is him in 15 years. Okay, so... <laughs> god! So this is what we're doing today, guys. Okay, I think he's gonna be chilling here next to the alligator because he's... That's where he feels like he fits in. Alright, so he's gonna be like... Sitting in a very bored position. He's bending forward a bit and looking over there to the side. Alright, I'm gonna have to get real close and personal here. Looks really sad. I'm feeling bad for him. Really receded hairline. That looks like a teenager in it. In it. All right. He should have some kind of really interesting fashion. Alien fashion. Oh shit! I like that. Maybe I'll take influence from the hair and the eyes. Let's say that he doesn't have a hairline like that after all. Damn, there we go. Now let's give him those shoulder pad thingies. I sure do hope Elon Musk sees this video. Fingerless gloves. It's really hard to tell that these are fingers, but let's just pretend that they are. All right, let's shade this, uh, this dude. All right, highlight time. Let's make him look really alien. Let's give him some metallic looking skin texture. All right, perfect, perfect, nice. Very good. I think the, the pants should be made of some kind of leather material or something shiny. Let's just add the big fat f***ing highlight. I'm, I'm pretty much done here. This is, I think, very close to what he will hopefully look like in 15 years. Damn, 15 years is not even that far away. I'll be 38 like i'll be still be in my 30s when this guy will be looking like this next victim go a burger fountain that dispenses baby hands draw one of Kanye west's tweets as a person draw my profile pic hell no stiller moon army plot twist they're all grown old man draw a buff ass ant a man but he's got a smaller man's face on his neck draw a tree with faces instead of leaves sunday dish but full of eyeballs an orphan crying because they have no family ah that's 
that's dark. Michael Jackson beep, 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 beeping in the back. A man whose body is covered with eyes that plants grow out of them. Draw a human doge playing the violin. Draw something your mother would like. Uh, please draw a bicycle riding a man. I'm trying to imagine what that would look like right now. Hatsune Miku beating up Putin, a Viking in a caravan. I like that for some reason. Your favorite animal with fur, except slimy. So if I were to draw like a cat or something, it would be slimy, right? All right, I think the slime cat should be right here. And walking towards uh, the, the bad boys. Green slime. Oh, that's cool. That's the type of slime I was thinking about. Let's do this thing. Cats are a difficult fucking thing to draw. And I don't know how to draw them from imagination. So I'm referencing this one. All right, something like that. Something like that. Something like that. Something, 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 nothing, nothing. British. Well, that looks sort of like a cat, I think. It's a little bit transparent, right? So we can see the bottom plane through the surface. <laughs> Okay, something like that to start off. SpaceX is going to deliver Nickelodeon slime to the space station. Nice. Continuing on the Elon Musk theme, even when I'm drawing slime. I think what I'm doing is more like jelly, not slime. Maybe I should go for something more like this. That's just green paint. I don't know, man. Okay, I'll just try to wing it, I guess. I'm trying to reference the Nickelodeon slime right now. The main thing where it's going to start popping is when I have those, those reflections of the environment. 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 I mean, now this looks like some kind of blend between jello and slime. I think uh, what will really make this pop would be doing like some driplet, dripping parts. All right, yeah, that's... That's something. I'll try to add in some real dark parts also. Pop off the contrast. Add some blue to the highlights so that it looks like it's reflecting the blue sky or something. Damn, this is harder than it looks. Adding in some of that blue on the top actually made it work somewhat. I mean, yeah, well, whatever. <laughs> Draw memes that were cool when you first started uploading videos. I first started uploading videos in 2009. Was troll face already a thing in 2009? I don't remember. Was that the thing in 2009? The the thoughtful raptor Homer simping over Meryl Milf Marge. Roman soldier snowboarding on his shield. It reminds me of my favorite game, Mord How. And there's always these people sliding around on their shields yelling, please do the Sailor Moon redraw with the 12 soon boy. Oh God, I did it with Marge Simpson. Ah, <laughs> draw a fish, DJ. Draw a man eating hand, bees. What parents see when they hear the word gamer. A cursed mermaid. Draw a veggie tails meeting annoying orange. That's a crossover that the world is not ready for. <laughs> you riding a bear. Putin style. Draw a Hydra, but all the heads look like you from different parts of your life. Early teen, late teen, young adult. I kind of like that, but it's too big of a commitment. <laughs> Vladimir Putin is a K-pop fan. Damn, Putin is really popular around here. Minecraft Steve, but round. I feel like somebody could have done that somewhere in the world. All right, that looks cursed. That looks really fucking cursed. Someone jumping from an airplane, but realizing that they don't have a parachute. Their backpack is full of Chala merch instead, so they're just falling through the sky with all this old ass gel emerge falling behind them. Unicorn with two corns. I like the wording of this. Draw a fish with legs. We should do a Roman soldier fish with the legs. Why does this look so cursed? Why do I like this? What the f I think I want to put him near the edge of the piece, otherwise he becomes too prominent. He needs to be here on the side, he's just about to sail off the piece. Time to stretch this bad boy out a bit because I feel like he's not dynamic enough. Does anybody know if there is a term for fish furries? I know they're scalies. But what about fish? Fishies? I need to know. <laughs> All 
right, first thing I'm gonna do is shade the armor, cause I like shading armor. I like doing metal. Oh, yeah, but adding those highlights onto those metallic surfaces is very satisfying. Basically adding in some reflections of the surrounding forest. That's where the green comes in. And then let's switch over to a light blue, which is kind of the sky, I, I guess. And then the parts that are totally white, the sun or the clouds or whatever. So if you guys want a tutorial on rendering metals, check out my last Toasting Your Art video. I did a segment there dedicated to that specifically. Yeah, I mean, like, I don't know why I'm still doing this. All right, let me just add a mask so that this tree would be in front of him. Perfect. We have reached peak performance. We, this, damn. All right, it is the next day now. I went to sleep and I woke up and I checked this out and, um, wow, that's epic. Chala draw fan art of Chala. Draw a drug dealer giving cocaine to anime samurai. Make whatever one of these common suggestions extra. Spongebob wearing a pants that aren't square. <laughs> a snake using his tail as a violin bow. Two big disembodied hands doing whatever you think they should be doing. Draw a person who is embarrassed. Draw the Pope with anime eyes. Draw a lizard in a pair of snakeskin pattern pants. And dress shoes. No shirt. He's very angry because the pants fit too small on him and the shoes are ten sizes too large. Draw Chala before he got his new job, and Chala after he got his new job. Nothing changed, they just get two years older. And knowing orange, God. What you think you'd look like in 50 years, not dead, but still wearing the clothes you do now. Elmo doing crack. Duck wearing boots. Draw someone standing on a beach, soaking in the breeze, staring at something in the distant sky. Draw someone taking a bath. All right, um, I made up my mind. All right, so this man will be, shall be taking a a bath in the river over here. Maybe he should be mad that the skater boy just skated over him. Okay, his legs coming forward too much. Delete, 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 abort. All right, so this is my main reference, this picture, because that I think it will fit on here just very nicely. Check this out. If I were to do it like this. <laughs> Damn, that head to body ratio though. That's what happens when you zoom in, guys. Don't zoom in. He has this very iconic fold between his eyes here that will make him recognizable and also those lines on his forehead you see it already looks like him but just by doing those two things damn that forehead size though all right perfection check this out all right let's do something very sketchy let's hit top Less. Now let's give him the appropriate body type also. Man, my two years of learning anatomy has led up to this. Drawing Gordon Ramsay screaming at the fish. I think I'm gonna keep his legs as is though. They're gonna be small. All right, there he is in his full glory. <laughs> All right, I feel like I want to work on the anatomy a bit more. I don't know why. All right, perfect. This is by far my favorite thing here <laughs> in this picture so far. Shading time. Let's make it a very beautiful, soft airbrushy shading. I don't know why, but I like working with airbrush. It's very nice. <laughs> skin tutorial if you're drawing people outside and you want to do highlights pick your main color and then go a bit more towards the gray side and a bit more up like it gives you that sky effect a little bit like it's a reflection of the sky there this is like the best uh, anatomy i've drawn in a while it's just so sad that it's on fucking gordon ramsay man <laughs> Oh, yeah. 
I absolutely despise this already. I don't want to see this. Why does he remind me of Jazza? All right, perfection. We've done it. Now to make him be underwater a little bit, just let's do a bit of this. Should also give him some ripples around him so it looks like he's actually in there. Now let's erase the part where his feet come out of the water. Can you draw the Kool-Aid man posing with the Pope? A man in a suit though, doing a silly walk, but his skin is covered in screaming mouths. Draw a sexy moth lady, that is all. You know what? We need some more females up in this picture. Draw Duft hurling a basketball at someone trying to kill them. Oh my god. This is a guy from my emo basketball story back in the day. Holy sh**. I don't remember what he looked like anymore though. Solid snake doing a midair split while shooting a rocket launcher. Boots wearing a duck. Oh, I see. Because somebody commented duck wearing boots before. A character from Animal Crossing wearing Jazza merch. Why is, is Jazza still, still a thing? Does he still make videos? Draw a juggalo frog. Draw a giraffe doing crack. Why? <laughs> Draw the letter H. An absolutely shredded Garfield friend. Draw a butterfly made of made out of butter, but make it realistic. <laughs> Draw a photographer with three hands doing this job. Dude, I like that. There should be somebody documenting this. I'm gonna go with the moth lady first. Just thinking about where to fit this moth lady in this picture, and I think. She should be this guy's girlfriend. Moth. That is epic. What shall the moth lady be like? Should she be flying? Now, the thing is, how do I make it more moth-y? Yes, I should do like this type of shit first and then like the eyes. I guess I need to do the wings. And of course the boobers. I really hope Elon Musk shares this picture. When this picture is done, everybody must tweet it at Elon Musk. Okay, I think I'm <laughs> done here. I have no idea what's going on with the face. I just referenced one image, this one for the face, and then I did this one. Yeah, I think they will fit together very nicely though. This guy's all wearing all dark. This girl will be wearing white. Very nice uh, contrast. For some reason I'm getting the vibes of like a video game enemy or something from like some MMO or some shit. <laughs> Alright, I think I want to do like some really white highlights on this one. Okay, that is epic if I do say so myself and I do say so. Well, this is something else. This is certainly something different in this picture. I think now is the time when I should do the thing where I blend them into the environment better because he's still on the water. He's not Jesus, so that needs to be fixed. I'm actually enjoying this a little bit as opposed to the previous episodes where was just torment. <laughs> All right, let's see what a typical photographer looks like. I think this is this is it. And I think he should be somewhere here in the very front. So he should be taking pictures of what's going on over here. And then with second hand, he's picturing this. And with the third hand, he's going to be doing the Karen back there. Maybe he should be using those vlogger cameras, the tiny ones. All right, so arm number one. Let's pretend that this is a camera, right? <laughs> if I draw like a flash here then we should be able to understand what it is. All right, so let's say that he has a mutation that gives him two arms on one side, but only one on the other. Yes, these are cameras, don't question it. Somewhere along the line, I must have decided that the photographer has no Clothing, so we can really see the three arms in their full glory. I don't know why, but this gives me like some kind of The Simpsons movie vibes where there is mutated creatures, like the fish with a thousand eyes, but this time there's a 
photographer who's green. How funny is that the only piece of pop culture that I know that includes radiation and mutated things is the Simpsons movie. Okay. <laughs> Why is he green? What the f I'm just rolling with it. I'm just making him green. All right, now, now, no, 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 it's time to make it flashy. Give the photographer some flashes. Mm, I feel like that's, that's still not enough. We need to do something more. Snap. Snap. Now this guy's Instagram will be popping after this. Now, since this guy's in the foreground, we should probably make him darker. So it looks like he's in the shadows or something. Now all that's left is the Karen in the background. That's all I need to do. Now I need, I need a reference for a typical Karen. What does a typical Karen look like? All right, perfect. That's it. That's what I need. I feel like I want to do like a very intense pose and it's going to be like, it's going to be a very angry pose, like Hulk, Hulk smash pose. Pose. We're gonna do a large head because otherwise it's not gonna be visible in the background there. This is it. We've done it, guys. We've done it. We drew the comments. Definitely one of my favorite episodes so far. Yeah, I feel accomplished. This is going straight into my portfolio. This will get me many jobs. If you would like to participate in the next drawing your comments, I've got the information for you right here, right now. Head over to my Instagram page. That's where I host all of my community events because I need to get my ass to 10K on Instagram so that when I post a new video here, I could insert the link to the announcement and the stories. And over there, I will post a post at one point announcing that I'm accepting comments, requests, and follow my ass over there. Here's, here's, here's my handle. The community has really come together with this one. Holy shit. All right, thanks, y'all.